I'm getting ready to ship an accordion that I just sold on eBay and I thought it might be helpful if I put a video on eBay both for the purchaser and for anybody purchasing accordions uh, who may not have purchased one before or may, may be their first time with an accordion of how to remove an accordion from a case. Uh, first of all, when this arrives, hopefully the accordion is wrapped in bubble wrap, but for demonstration purposes uh, I have not wrapped this one yet. Uh, the accordion, uh, you might be able to tell in the video, probably can't, but this one has had the shoulder straps from it removed. And that's normally the procedure, so that the shoulder straps don't in any way harm the accordion, and they allow you to uh, wrap it in bubble wrap easier. Uh, when you remove the shoulder straps uh, separately, you will find that one of them is probably longer than the other one, and uh, that's as it should be. The left shoulder strap should be shorter and the right shoulder strap should be longer. Uh, you'll need to adjust them to your own length anyway so to fit yourself so I'm not going to tell you exactly how long they should be because you'll have to learn that by trial and error. But when you go to remove the accordion and it'll be a little easier perhaps the first time when it's wrapped in bubble wrap uh, but after when it's not wrapped in bubble wrap and you're getting your accordion in and out of the case occasionally, if you're taking it someplace to play, uh, the thing to remember is that these base buttons, if pushed back against the back of the case, and they do set with the base towards the bottom of the case so that when it sits up, it's sitting, the accordion sitting on its feet. It'll have feet on the base side, but you don't want to take it out by tilting it that way because if you tilt too far, you accidentally hit those base buttons against there, you can bend them so that they'll stick instead of coming straight up through the holes that they're supposed to come through. Push them down and they stick. So remember to lift the base buttons out first so they clear the baseboard and then the treble key section out later. Uh, then when you put the accordion back in the case, the exact opposite, put the treble key side down into the front of the case and lower it into the case like that. Then you're ready to close the case. With some old accordions, many of the cases are designed such that this latch won't latch unless you slide the button over and let it slide back and hold it. And that's all there is to it. You're ready to lift your accordion and carry it. However, when you do carry it, older accordion in an older case, carry it with the top towards your leg so that if the latches should happen to break and comes open, the accordion won't fall out as it would if the top were on the other side. Uh, so that's the end of this video. Hopefully it's helpful to a new accordion uh, purchaser. And uh, I've got a new YouTube channel here. And I hope that you'll check back in. From time to time I'll be putting some basic information about accordions up on YouTube. Thank you and that's all for this video.